Where can we go to find meaning? Come on. Connection. <laughs> Some greater truth. We live in a golden age of communication, but often we're lost in it. The deadly violence and chaos. The, the news comes at us faster than ever before. It polarizes and divides us. What's missing is meaning. That's why I've been walking continuously across the world since 2013. As a Pulitzer Prize winning journalist and National Geographic fellow, I struggled with gaps in my own reporting because I had to move too quickly. Now, I'm gathering the stories of the people I meet and writing about the global issues I encounter at boot level, one footstep at a time. My name is Paul. I'm Paul Salopek, and my project is the Out of Eden Walk. Seven years ago, I set out on foot from Africa's Rift Valley and began my journey to Tierra del Fuego in South America. I wanted to follow in the footsteps of our ancestors who, pushed by famines and competition and pulled by a tireless quest for resources, spread out of Africa to discover the world. Over the last 11,000 miles, I have followed their footsteps, writing about our own struggles with similar problems today. And in this way, the Out of Eden Walk has become a unique global studio for a different kind of storytelling, what we're calling slow journalism. Whether the topics are climate change, mass migration, or a fraying environment, the journey's storytelling has reached a global audience of tens of millions. Out of Eden Walk has published eight articles in National Geographic magazine and almost 400 online dispatches, an unprecedented level of coverage in National Geographic's history. Millions more readers find the walk's storytelling elsewhere. Our social media following continues to expand, and our narratives have been shared globally in 34 languages. Sometimes people ask, what's the most profound gift of the walk? And that's easy. It's not mine anymore. It's a journey shared. We've built a global community of thoughtful, slow storytellers in our wake, dedicated to promoting people-to-people -people connectivity across borders. National Geographic helped us pioneer slow journalism workshops for young media professionals in India, whose work has been seen by 25 million readers. Project Zero at Harvard innovated an award-winning education program that links thousands of students across the world to the walk. The Pulitzer Center on Crisis Reporting uses the walk's lessons in classrooms across the United States. And to think, we've still 14,000 miles ahead of us. Come walk with us. Join our global coalition of storytellers as we walk together into a challenging new century. The journey belongs to everyone. We need good pathfinders now more than ever. Slow down and look and listen. Take time to tell the story.